Check this out. This is a model of NASA's latest solar sail. You might say it looks like a giant tinfoil kite. This new larger sail was developed in part at NASA's Langley Research Center in Hampton, and it could help revolutionize space travel. You could use this to carry a science instrument like... Scientists say one of the big problems with sending things to space is how much fuel it takes to even get into orbit. Then, if you want to go anywhere, you need even more fuel. But not with this solar sail. The real solar sail is about 860 square feet and comes at a cost of around $20 million. It all folds up into a small box about the size of a microwave that a company will launch into space from New Zealand soon. The primary objective is just to demonstrate that we can deploy this thing. So here's how it works. Instead of having a rocket engine and fuel, this solar sail deploys using energy from the sun to push it around in space, much like wind hitting a ship's sails. If all goes well, these sails could be used for a variety of things and could lead to even bigger sails. If you put one of these like at the Earth-Sun Lagrange point, you could have an advanced detection system to let you know that a solar storm is happening and you know you need to shut down your satellites to protect things. The carbon fiber pieces that make up the frame of this sail could even be used to build structures on the moon. We're really, really interested in the idea of using them for towers, for communications. Here on this table is some of the material these sails are made out of. You can see it's super light and even floats in the air. This project has been about five years in the making and has involved both the Langley Research Center at Hampton and NASA's Ames Research Center in California. Once the mission is over, the sail will fall back to Earth and burn up as it re-enters the atmosphere. After five years um, through COVID, when we were shut down, and then when we finally started to come back slowly to work on this, uh, it's, it is a real, little surreal to see it finally going up into space. This solar sail mission is expected to last six to nine months. In Hampton, Coulter and Staff News 3.